Hey guys, it's Paige and today I'm going to teach you guys how to transform your tea and I'm going to do a new series that is transform your tea and I'm going to show you guys how to take like plain shirts and kind of like spice them up, make them really cute and just kind of things that maybe you guys did already know how to do or some things you guys didn't know how to do. Um, this is going to be all DIY and stuff like that. If you guys have any suggestions for anything um, for the series, please leave it in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. You will need a plain white t-shirt, a colored pencil, scissors, a ruler, in either fabric paint or acrylic paint and different size brushes. You're going to start by drawing the neckline on the t-shirt and you're going to want this to go down into a pretty a uh, low scoop neck depending on like how high you want it or like how much cleavage or whatever you guys want to show um, and then you're going to take the scissors and start cutting from the side shoulders and make sure you don't cut the back so cut it to about the middle and what I like to do is flip the half that I've already done and just kind of trace it along with the scissors so that I don't have to remeasure and everything like that and it's very symmetrical and that's the way that I get my shirts really even. And then to cut the back of the t-shirt you're going to do basically the same thing that you did on the front with the whole flapping over thing and cutting along the edge of that line. Okay, so for the sleeves, I don't really know how else to explain this just because I kind of freehand it, but some tips are that you should definitely uh, cut past the um, armpit like seam, and if you guys want to go lower so that it's kind of like drooped down a little bit, you can go ahead and do that, but I just uh, kept it right at the armpit because that's where I like my tank tops to fall. So taking the sleeve that you just cut off, you're going to flip it and move it to the other sleeve and you can either trace over it or just cut right along the lines because this helps make it symmetrical. Then try your top on and mark where you want to cut it. Uh, so if you want your shirt to be a little bit shorter, like either a crop top or just a little bit shorter, I draw a line and then I use the roller to make sure it's straight and then I cut all the way through and yeah. Then taking a piece of cardboard, just stick it in between the shirts so that when you start to paint, it will not bleed through or stick to the back. So to paint the heart, I literally just paint a heart but the first time I do it with a, pair, a fairly like thin line just so if you make a tiny mistake it won't be that big of a deal and then I go in and fill it in and you can either make it really kind of messy if you like that style or you can go in and kind of fill it in and make it like a little bit more clean. 